Hey guys, today I'm going to show you different ways to make candy propellant using potassium nitrate and sugar. I'll start by showing you the most conventional way. To do this, simply mix 65 grams of potassium nitrate with 35 grams of sugar. And gently heat the mixture with enough water so all the crystals dissolve. Feel free to add more water if it doesn't dissolve enough. Unlike the smoke composition, the sugar must not caramelize. To accelerate the combustions, it's possible to add 1% ferric oxide. As soon as you get a thick paste, remove from the heat and fill your engine tubes. In this video I'm using tubes made with homemade pyro glue. I'll make a video about that later. I don't like this method because it's not very practical to fill tubes and the past requires quite a long time to dry. The second technique is simpler. Simply mix 65 grams of potassium nitrate with 35 grams of sugar. And you can also add 1 gram of iron oxide. But this time everything is reduced to a fine powder using a blender. Here I'm directly using powdered sugar. This time we obtain a powder that works just as well as the previous technique. In fact, it works even better sometimes.
The third method is really similar to the first one, except that once you get a thick paste, you spread it and you let it dry, stirring regularly. It's possible to put it back on the heat a few seconds to speed up the drying process. Once it's dry, we get what looks like a granulated powder. It is then crushed in a mortar with a pestle, or you can also put it in a bag and crush it with a hammer. I really appreciate this technique because it's quick and easy to fill tubes, unlike the two other methods. It is also a good technique if you want to store the powder and quickly use it later, because it's not hygroscopic. When it's well done, it burns almost like commercial black powder. You can find other techniques and better composition on the website extreme-experiments.com I will show you how to use candy propellant to make rockets and missiles in an upcoming video so don't forget to subscribe. See you soon!